Hi, I'm Taka. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to introduce frozen chahan. Chahan is a Japanese fried rice dish and it's also called yakimeshi. Preparing it is easy. You only need to prepare cooked rice and the leftovers in the fridge. So many people enjoy fried rice dishes as homemade food. Many noodle shops have fried rice on the menu. I will be reviewing two popular frozen fried rice products. One is from Nichirei Foods Incorporated, and the other one is from Ajinomoto Company Incorporated. I have eaten Nichirei's chahan many times, but Ajinomoto's is my first try, so I'm excited. The first one is Honkaku Itame Chahan. It means professionally fried fried rice. It is listed in the Guinness Book as the number one in annual sales in the frozen fried rice category in 2020. It's the most sold frozen fried rice for 20 consecutive years now in Japan. In fact, this year they are celebrating 20th anniversary of the product. It sounds invincible. The package contains 450 grams and they set a discretionary price for the product, but it's around 260 yen, about 2.37 US dollars. I will microwave half of the quantity for 3 minutes and 50 seconds at 600 watts. Grilled pork, green onion, and stuffed fried eggs are in chaha. Nutrition facts and allergen alert are in my blog article. Check it out if you need it. Itadakimasu. This is Nichiroi's chaha. It's so good. The sweetness of dashi flavor is so good. I think it's a mixture of meat and vegetables. It has gentle and hearty taste. The grilled pork is sweet and I ate a similar pork dish in Taiwan. I wonder how long they spent to develop this amazing chaha. Its quality is so high. I can understand why it's in the Guinness Book's list and it catches everyone's heart. The second one is the chaha from Ajinomoto. According to its website, they quested for the fried rice that men worldwide devour intensely. They are dead serious about making it their masterpiece. I think they had to be serious to beat their rival's number one chaha. Nichirei awakens the giant within Ajinomoto. It's so good for customers like us because we benefit from their competition since they are always coming out with the best chaha. I saw a guy coming to me quickly in a supermarket when I grabbed a Nichirei's chahan. He grabbed Ajinomoto's chahan without hesitation and walked away. He looked so determined. It was like a scene from a movie to me. Every time I see Ajinomoto's chahan, he comes to my mind. The package contains 600 grams and they set a discretionary price for the product but it's from 430 to 550 yen, from 3.90 to 5 US dollars. I will microwave half of the quantity for 5 minutes and 30 seconds at 600 watts. Grilled pork, green onion, and stuffed fried eggs are in chaha. Itadakimasu. This one's Ajinomoto's chaha. It's good. The pepper's taste is strong. The scent of burned green onion's oil is so good. This chaha is salty, especially grilled pork. 
If you like thick, salty, and oily noodles, you may like this product. To be honest, it didn't exceed my expectation. I think this product's target is young males. But this is just my personal opinion. Some people love this, like the guy I met in a supermarket. Today, I introduced frozen chaham. The level of the frozen food in Japan is very high. You can enjoy amazing frozen chaham at home. If you are busy, you don't have to go to ramen shops. I will introduce other delicious frozen food some other time, so stay tuned. To know what delicious product I will be reviewing next, stay until the end of this video to find out what it is. If you like my video, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks so much for watching my video. I'll see you in the next video. Mata ne!